Hi Crystals, welcome back to Stardew Valley. Today I am back with another house design for Stardew Valley 1.5 update. Since you guys love the previous one so much here is one more for you. Plus the Ginger Island house design is coming soon too so stay tuned. Okay so, without further ado let's begin the time lapse. Now this is not mandatory to just make this room into a living room this is totally your choice. Moving on to the next room which is the storage room. Now you guys know about the vast variety of things that are in the game so to store them we obviously need a storage room. So here is one. The reason why I choose this room is because this room is square in shape and by putting chests into it. It actually looks very organized. I am so nifty you know. <laughs> Moving to the next room that is obviously the kitchen. Now this design is very simple. Because a kitchen is a kitchen nothing special. But one thing that is special is the sewage pipe. I cannot understand the reason why I placed it there in the first place. Moving on to the next room which is the sewing room. Now the 1.5 update has brought a lot for us, including the new sewing machine. Now we won't have to worry about going to Emily's house again and again. I found this idea being unique so I thought why not. Moving on to the master bedroom. Now in the previous video we made separate rooms for children and for Alex. But now we will make a single bedroom for both the cases. Though there is a wall in between which kind of separates it but anyways, it is just a single room okay. Now by adding the beds we add other epic stuff. Just a reminder this is the last room. Now the quick look. I hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching.